Hello, my name is Joshua Brown from the interview training company howtobecome.com and in this presentation I will teach you how to pass your photographer interview. So if you have a photography interview coming up for any organisation or any industry then please make sure you watch this video from start to finish because I'm going to help you to stand out and succeed. To achieve that goal this is what I'll cover. I'll start off by giving you a list of photographer interview questions that I strongly recommend you prepare for. I'll then provide you with example high scoring answers to those questions to help you to succeed. Plus I'll also make sure to give you some essential tips for passing your photographer interview before finally telling you how you can instantly download these slides plus 21 great answers to photographer interview questions in a PDF guide. And just very quickly please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I want to help you to pass your interview by giving you brilliant answers to the toughest photographer interview questions and I can only do that if you are subscribed. And please don't forget to hit that like button because this tells me you find these tutorials useful. Okay, let's take a look at that first photographer interview question, which is tell me about yourself. Now this is a brilliant opportunity to get your interview off to a flying start and impress the hiring manager. You can be the standout candidate by focusing your answer on the following things. Firstly, mention the skills and qualities that you have. Do not talk about your home life or your personal life unless it's relevant to the job role itself. Instead, you could focus on your experience and your passion for working in the role and how you're going to add value to their company. That's really important. A great way to do all of this is to make sure you study the job description and focus on telling the interview panel how your skills are a perfect match for those that they desire. So for example, if on the job description it states they're seeking someone who has great communication and customer service abilities or a great technical mindset, then make sure throughout your photographer interview answers you use those exact terms. So let's take a look at a brilliant top scoring answer to help you. Tell me about yourself. Thank you for inviting me to be interviewed for this position today. I am a passionate photographer with over seven years of professional experience, specialising in portrait and event photography. I hold a bachelor's degree in fine arts with a focus on photography from the Stanford University. My journey began with a simple point and shoot camera capturing moments that spoke to me. Realising the power of visual storytelling, I decided to turn my passion into a career. I've had the privilege of working with diverse clients from individuals to corporations and my work has been featured in several art galleries and magazines. My approach is a blend of technical skill and artistic intuition, aiming to create images that evoke emotion and resonate with the audience. I'm proficient in Adobe Photoshop and Lightroom and I continually invest in upgrading my skills and equipment to stay ahead in this ever evolving field. I'm excited about the opportunity to bring my unique vision and expertise to your esteemed organisation. Wow, what a powerful way to kickstart your interview and be the standout candidate. Remember, by giving a confident answer like this to that opening interview question, not only will you impress the hiring manager, but you'll also gain confidence in the rest of your answers to come. Okay, let's take a look at the next photographer interview question, which is why do you want to work in photography? I'm seeing this question come up time and time again. The best way to answer it is to be passionate and personal. Express your genuine passion for capturing moments and emotions and share personal experiences or stories that led you to pursue a career in photography. That's a great way to be personable and connect with the hiring manager. Tip number two, align your goals with their needs. That is so important. You must clearly align your professional goals, skills and artistic approach with the company's needs and values and their mission. This demonstrates that your unique perspective can add value to their team. So let's take a look at a brilliant top scoring answer to help you. Why do you want to work in photography? Photography is not just a profession for me, it's a calling. From a young age, I've been captivated by the ability of a single image to tell a complex story, evoke emotions and freeze a moment in time. 
What draws me to photography is its unique blend of art and technology, where both creative vision and technical expertise are essential. I find immense satisfaction in capturing the nuances of light, emotion and atmosphere, transforming them into visual narratives. It's a field that never ceases to challenge and inspire me. Every shoot presents a new set of variables, lighting conditions, subject personalities and client expectations, making it a continuously evolving learning experience. The joy I feel when I nail that perfect shot or exceed a client's expectations is indescribable. For me, photography is not just about making a living, it's about making a difference through the lens. I can't imagine doing anything else. Now don't go anywhere as I still have more interview questions and answers to give you. But when you're ready and if you want to, please click that link in the top right hand corner. It will take you through to my website, howtobecome.com, where you can download my 21 photographer interview questions and answers for all organizations to give you the edge in your interview, including the ones we're covering right now. Okay, here is the next question for you. Why should we hire you for this photography job? Now this is your chance to show the interviewer your best qualities, experience and competence to carry out the role. So you could say for example, you have a proven track record of success, that you have the technical experience relevant to the role, or that your skills and qualities match the job description perfectly, that's a great thing to say, and that you have passion for the company's values and goals. Again, another great tip here is to make sure you study the job description and focus on telling them how your skills are a perfect match to those that they desire. So let's take a look at a brilliant top scoring answer to help you. Why should we hire you for this photography job? I bring a unique combination of technical proficiency, artistic vision and professional experience to the table. With over seven years in the field, I've honed my skills in various types of photography, from portraiture to commercial shoots. I'm highly skilled in post-production, proficient in Adobe Photoshop and Lightroom, ensuring that the final product meets the highest quality standards. My portfolio showcases a wide range of styles and techniques, reflecting my adaptability and keen eye for detail. I pride myself on my strong work ethic and commitment to meeting deadlines without compromising on creativity. I'm also a great communicator, which helps me understand client needs and collaborate effectively with team members. My previous clients have praised my ability to deliver beyond expectations, both in terms of quality and service. Hiring me would not just be filling a position, it would be adding value to your team and exceeding the creative benchmarks you've set. Okay, the next photography interview question is this. How do you handle a client who has an entirely different vision of what they want compared to what you think would look best? Wow, that's a tough question to answer. Now here is my tip, emphasize clear communication and understanding. If you highlight your ability to listen attentively and ask clarifying questions to fully understand the client's vision, you will ensure that you can address their needs accurately while explaining your professional perspective and make sure you demonstrate flexibility and collaboration when answering this interview question. You must showcase your willingness to be flexible and collaborate with the client to find a middle ground that combines their preferences with your expertise, resulting in a mutually satisfactory outcome. So let's take a look at a great example answer to help you. How do you handle a client who has an entirely different vision of what they want compared to what you think would look best? In situations where a client's vision diverges from my own professional perspective, the key is to open communication and collaboration. First, I make sure to listen carefully to the client's ideas, asking questions to fully understand their vision and objectives. Once I have a clear picture, I'll present my own suggestions, explaining the artistic and technical reasoning behind them. I often find that showing visual examples can help bridge the gap between differing viewpoints. If the client is still committed to their original vision, my role is to execute it to the best of my ability, while ensuring technical excellence. After all, the client's satisfaction is the ultimate goal. 
However, if there's room for compromise, I aim for a collaborative approach that combines the client's ideas with my expertise to create something exceptional. This way, we both contribute to the final outcome, ensuring a result that exceeds expectations. Okay, the next photography interview question is this. Can you describe your photography style? Now here are two tips for you. Tip number one, be clear and concise. Clearly articulate the defining elements of your photography style, focusing on aspects like composition, lighting, subject matter and mood to give the interviewer a vivid picture of your work. And tip number two, make sure you relate to the job. And what I mean by that is you must align your style with the requirements of the job that you're applying for. Again, read that job description in detail and match it with your answer. So you can demonstrate how your unique approach to photography can complement and enhance the company's aesthetic and project goals. Here is a top scoring answer to help you. Can you describe your photography style? My photography style is best described as a blend of candid and conceptual. I strive to capture the essence and emotion of the moment, allowing subjects to be themselves while also incorporating elements of composition, lighting and background to elevate the image. I have a keen eye for detail and a deep appreciation for aesthetics, which drives me to create visually striking images that resonate with viewers. My approach is versatile, allowing me to adapt my style to suit the subject matter, whether it be a lively event, a serene landscape or a dynamic portrait. I believe in the power of simplicity and often employ a minimalist approach to composition, focusing on the subject and eliminating distractions. This style enables me to produce images that are not only visually appealing, but also rich in narrative, inviting viewers to see beyond the surface and connect with the story within. So the next thing to do if you want to get the full list of 21 photographer interview questions and if you want to accelerate your learning even further to pass your interview at the first attempt is to click that link right now in the top right hand corner of this video for two reasons. The first reason is it will take you through to my website howtobecome.com we can get all of these answers we just covered, plus a total of 21 brilliant responses to photographer interview questions. And secondly, the next reason is, I've given you three smart questions to ask at the end of your photographer interview on that page. It's a brilliant resource, guaranteed to help you prepare effectively for your interview, and also more importantly, put you ahead of the competition. Make sure you check out that link. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Please don't forget to subscribe as I'm on a mission to help as many people as possible pass their job interviews. And I can only do that if you are subscribed. Please also hit that like button as that encourages me to make more videos just like these. If you have any questions regarding specifics, do let me know in the comment section below where I'll get back to you with more interview tips and advice. And finally, don't forget to connect with me on LinkedIn. I've put my LinkedIn link in the description below. It's always great to connect with like-minded professionals such as yourself. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best for your interview. Have a brilliant day.